Hello guys, how are we? Welcome back to my channel. Hope everyone's doing really well. Sorry, I feel like it was a random start to the video. I am in Madrid. So exciting. Never been here before. Very last minute trip. I'm with my dad. But yeah, I'm here in Madrid for three days. And I just thought, let's do a little vlog. But yeah, I just inserted some clips beforehand just of what we've been doing just for the morning. Um, we landed here at about 12 o'clock. We couldn't actually check into the hotel um, because our room wasn't ready. Um, so we just went out. We went out to the little square. We've had a walk around, had some drinks, had some lunch. Um, we've just got back. It's currently quarter to five now. Had a really nice day. It is so hot. Oh my gosh, it's like 30 degrees. Can't explain how warm it is. It's beautiful, like literally beautiful weather. It said today, like when I looked in the week, it said like really hot. And then when I checked yesterday, it just said it was cloudy all day. And I was like, oh, and when we landed, it was a little bit cloudy. But honestly, it is so sunny, blue skies, boiling. Like I'm so hot, that's just put the aircon on. I've just checked into my room. I'll do a little room tour for you. But yeah, really excited. My dad at seven, there's a rooftop bar here. So we're going to go for drink on the rooftop bar then we're going for dinner at eight i bought like a bit of an earlier dinner well normally i go for dinner at like half nine on holiday um but for that's a bit too late so yeah i've got a nice dinner at eight. Oh yeah but should i show you the room so i don't know why i'm like out of breath but i'm so hot i've like been trying to get the air con to work because it is boiling but let's do a little room tour so yeah i found it so hard to find a hotel like literally everywhere was booked and i only booked this about three days ago very last minute trip um so those of the hotels I'm looking at were sold out found this hotel it's called you music right in the center gorgeous and look at this room so i've got a very very windy staircase <laughs> it literally makes me dizzy going up it i don't know why i've got this crazy staircase all the way up coming into here i love the floor i think the floor is so nice and then here is the bedroom how insane is this room i can't believe how nice this bedroom is and look they've left i would actually eat this but honestly i've just had this for lunch it looks gorgeous though i'm gonna put it in the fridge um because it just looks so nice but i just had a really nice like tapas lunch for my dad um but yeah here's the room gorgeous bed they have really beautiful paintings like all on the walls around the hotel which is so nice a sink Hi guys, got a sink, lovely mirror. I've actually got a bath as well, which is so nice. I kind of like it's hidden around here. I feel like you can just have a very relaxing bath. And then we've got a shower, gorgeous. And then a toilet, amazing. And then we go back around here. It's actually got like a little seating area as well. Oh, another toilet. Like, I mean, oh, I've got two toilets, that's mad. And then a really cute little chaise long. Um, and TV. But then, this is the best bit. Generally, when I booked it, I actually did not have any idea that this room had this. Like, I saw this and I was like, what, is this a shared one? But no, well, what the hell, like my own terrace. Oh, what? I can't explain how warm it is out here as well. I'm getting straight in my bikini for an hour. I'm getting right out here. Super cute. So this is the, um, wait, this is the pool area somewhere. Oh, where the umbrellas are, the pool area is here. And then this is like a little rooftop bar. I'm gonna go for a drink before we go out. Uh, how exciting. I did not think it's gonna be this one, but it's so hot. I'm actually gonna just go and sit out on the balcony for an hour. I was thinking I'm gonna have an hour nap before I need to start getting ready because I'm not gonna lie, guys. I'm very, very tired. Like I've seen that terrace and I'm like, girl, tan before a nap always because in two days time, I'm back home to English weather. I'm gonna phone my mom and it's been raining all day. So I just thought I need to make the most of it. So I'm actually just going super cash tonight. I'm just putting my hair up. I'll have a shower, but I'm not gonna actually wash my hair i'm just gonna slick my hair back do kind of min minimal makeup and i'm wearing flats and just trousers tonight like really casual so it's not gonna take me long to get ready but i am gonna film it for tiktok so it's monday today i'm here tuesday 
um, watching the Champions League game tomorrow and then Wednesday our flight is actually not till 4.45 so I've got um, like a really nice morning and afternoon. I'll catch up with you guys when I'm outside tanning. so warm it's so nice so yeah this is where i will be for the next hour with me for dinner in madrid so i'm just heading out for dinner this evening i'm in madrid for a few days with my dad i believe how nice the weather's been today it's been 30 degrees it is so hot i got here at like 12 o'clock in the afternoon so i've been out exploring this afternoon i had some tapas for lunch which was really yummy and some afro spritz um, and then I came back to the hotel and I was just chilling out on the terrace. It's I'm flagging a little bit. I'm so tired. I had literally no sleep last night, but I'm excited for dinner. So I've been using the Estee Lauder Futurist Hydra Rescue. This is really good. SPF 45. I honestly love this so much. And then just some NARS concealer. I don't want anything too heavy on my skin this evening. So I'm actually skipping a cream contour, which I never do, but I just feel like I want a real fresh kind of look for tonight. I'm using the Glossier Cloud Paint in the shade Beam. I got this the weekend. I'm in love. It's such a beautiful colour. And also just a really easy product to use. I'm going to go in with a little bit of the Charlotte Tilbury Pink Gasm. Apologies to the lighting. Like, why is it hotel rooms just... The lighting is never good, is it? Let's be honest. I'm going to use my Charlotte Tilbury powder and just lightly dust just on the face. Make sure I kind of um, put powder on most areas of my face because I kid you not guys it's nearly eight o'clock and it's still 30 degrees well it's so warm sorry no nearly seven o'clock um so warm and we're going to um like a rooftop bar before dinner um so we're going to be sitting outside so yeah I need to make sure this is not melting off taking my pixie eye pencil and then just a little angled brush I've been obsessed with doing this rather than liquid eyeliner at the minute I just love it my brush is literally the wrong way. L'Oreal Telescopic. This is like my favourite mascara at the minute. Just done Refi Fawn Liner. And then I'm just going to do a clear gloss. This is Anastasia. Mm, smells good. So we're going for egg vibes tonight with the hair up. Let's get ready for dinner in Madrid. This light is just making my spot look. So I want to go like classy casual for tonight um i'm actually going out to a rooftop bar before dinner outside to a restaurant so i don't want to wear heels i want to wear like flats and just keep it really nice and like classy and casual so i'm gonna put on my favorite trousers from zara i'm sure i spoke about these before these are like just the best trousers i got them a few years ago so i don't know the code i'm really sorry but the color the fit everything i always reach for these i wear them so much because they're just always perfect then I have this really nice top from Source Unknown. You're going to have to wait till it's on because it's like very confusing. It crosses here. I feel like these will hopefully go really nice together. And I feel like this is just giving me like the Spanishy kind of vibe. So let's put this on. Okay, so here's the outfit. I think it looks really cute. Apologies if you can see like a mark here. I got makeup on it, so I've had to <laughs> scrub it. I love these trousers. I just think they're so nice perfect for like casual and also dressy and this top is really cute i'm not gonna wear any necklaces because um of this neckline i'm just gonna keep it completely plain i got these sunglasses which are so cute i feel like it just goes the whole like gold vibe and obviously as we're sitting outside um on the roof terrace i feel like i'll definitely need sunglasses i'm not just being bougie so I'm just popping on my Hermes sandals. So here we have the outfit for my Spanish sunset evening. This is the hotel. Wow.
spies. I hate a spice margarita. I thought it was a normal one, but it's a spice one. I hate it. <laughs> Just come up to the roof terrace. <laughs> got a glass of wine. Dad's got a beer. <laughs> Oh, thank you. Thanks. This is where we came before. It's really cute. Let's see. <laughs> Hello, darlings. I'm just getting ready for bed. It is midnight. Had a really lovely evening. Honestly, today has just felt like it's gone on forever. It does not feel like this morning that I was at the airport. You know when you like kind of have an early flight and you get here early? I love that. I always will try and do a flight that does that. Um, yeah, I feel like we've had like a really full day today, which has been really nice. I don't feel like it's been rushed or we've not had that much time. Like I feel like, I wouldn't say we've done a lot. We've not done like crazy much. We've had like a really nice day. Chilling. So yeah, dinner was lovely. Had some really good food. I think I filmed bits of the food and then we just came back and went for a drink on the rooftop, which was really cute. I'm really tired though now. I am flagging. Um, so yeah, I'm going to have a nice sleep. I'm so excited for a sleep. Yeah, I don't know what we're going to do tomorrow. I want to go and have a look around some of the shops and stuff. Um, and then I want to just have a nice chill at the hotel, maybe for a bit, like on the, on the pool or like on the terrace. Just a nice kind of chill day. My skin is not skinning right now. I've had a bit of a breakout. I have no idea why. Um, maybe because I've been using like a lot of different skincare products recently. Um, I mean, it's really not that bad at all. I mean, I'm a little bit dramatic, but I've just got quite a few like spots but I will. it's fine oh, very comfy this bed is oh, so I'm gonna love you and leave you and I will speak to you guys in the hello morning. guys get ready with me for a day in Madrid so I have this cute little dress from House of CB which I think I'm gonna put on and then I did have like a blazer shirt combo to put over it I don't know what I was thinking, but it's so hot here. It's literally boiling. It's like 30 degrees. So the blaze is getting ditched, but I do feel like I'm going to put a shirt over it still just to make it a bit more exciting. So let's put this on. So this is the dress on. It's just a really cute, like, mini dress. You could definitely wear this more dressed up as well, but I'm going casual today. Oh, guys, I've had a nightmare. So here's my shirt. It's just a plain white Zara shirt. It was so creased and there's no iron in the room so i hung it up in the shower like on the back of the door um try and get some creases out and it's absolutely soaking wet but like, it's soaking i don't even know if i want to wear it i don't know if it looks right because i had a blazer over the top it looked cute with that but i don't know if i'm feeling it okay maybe we just don't do a jacket it is literally 30 degrees anyway but i'm gonna put on my loafers i've just got some little white socks as well because i do think they look very cute put them on okay so here's the outfit with the shoes i feel like they are like marmite you either love them or you hate them but i am a lover i think they're very very cute very preppy so yeah so this was the original plan you see with like an oversized blazer it's like layering and really cute but I'm going to have to take this off in about one second because it's so hot. So, yeah, I think just the shirt on its own, it's giving, like, a doctor's kind of vibe because it's very oversized. I feel like I'm about to go a little, like, yeah, no, just no. So I'm just popping on my usual jewellery and sunnies. Here is the finished look. Okay, I've changed again. I've actually gone with this shirt over it. 
Hello guys, good morning. I have just been getting ready. I have been filming my get readies or like get dressed with me for TikTok so I feel like I might just insert them throughout this video. And then we're just about to head out now. We're gonna go and have a look at some of the shops, get some lunch later, probably stop and get like a coffee or something. Let's have like a nice chilled, nice chilled morning. Just in the theatre, in the hotel. It's so pretty. I had a look in this hotel. It actually used to be like a really famous theatre. And they've made it into a hotel. They have still kept the theatre. So I think they do like shows and performances. Like they're getting ready for something in here. But it's so cute. I'm obsessed with the ceiling. I'm glad I went for the shirt in the end. Like it is very hot, but I'm happy that I did put a shirt on. But no, just having a really nice time. Just went and had a coffee in this really cute little courtyard. I did film a little bit in there. So pretty. Um, but yeah, just gonna get some lunch in a bit, but just having a little mooch round. <laughs> Hello guys, I'm back. I've had such a lovely day. It's been so nice, the weather. Got to leave in an hour and 15 minutes, so I'm just gonna jump straight in the shower, wash my hair and everything. Um, and then yeah, starting to get ready. live from my hotel room bed i've just got some room service i'm about to eat it how are we so i know last time i was in madrid now i'm in london it's a probably a whole week later you know how my vlogs are going at the minute <laughs> but yeah i had an amazing time in madrid wow madrid was insane like i really want to go back there for like a city break it was amazing like beautiful city the weather was stunning i loved it so much i've never been there before seriously want to go back the game was great I had a really good time um yeah i didn't vlog much after that but we just left the next day um <clears throat> and now i'm in london um i've not long got here i've literally just got straight into my pajamas and straight into bed it's like half nine i didn't get here till quite late yeah i am here with l'oreal paris i've got the prince's trust awards tomorrow which is super exciting i'm about to eat um i have got some tomato soup i then got this chicken i mean it doesn't look the best but it's like a crispy chicken but it does look I feel like it'd be really nice with some lemon, but tomato salad. And then these, I asked for chips. You know, sometimes you just want a good chip, but these are actually really good. So I'm gonna eat this. Good now. morning, good morning. How are we? I have just got out of the shower. Oh. And I've just realized I forgot a hairbrush. I always forget hairbrushes, you know, when I go places. And I've just washed all my hair and the shampoo and the conditioner wasn't great um fuck, i've got to go and get my hair and makeup done i feel like my hair's a big knot <laughs> oh i'm literally brushing my hair with my nails i mean it's fine they'll have a brush obviously when they're doing my hair but oh, i could really do with giving this a good brush um it's like just after eight <clears throat> Got my hair and makeup being done at nine. I just chilled last night. I had my room service. You know we love a little Netflix update, okay? Firefly Lane. Oh, I started watching the last episode of it last night. And guys, I actually had to turn it off. Like I got 
10, well, I got about 15 minutes into it and I was like, no, no, because I'm going to be a wreck. <laughs> I'm going to be a full on wreck if I carry on watching it. I was already crying. So I just thought, no, I can't do it. Um, yeah, it's so good. I've absolutely binged it. I downloaded some on the plane there and back. Um, and yeah, I've absolutely binged it the last few days. You know when you've got like a series and like all you feel like you can do with your life is just get through that series. That's what I'm doing. Every spare second of that the minute, I've just been watching it. So yeah, I'm excited for today. Do you want a sneak peek at my dress? It's this gorgeous David Coma dress. Kind of hard to see, but it's all silver and sparkly. Truthfully, guys, it's not like my normal thing. Like, sorry. Um, I'm quite like simple with my things. Like, I do like just very simple stuff. And I just thought, you know what? I'll be a bit daring sometimes. I'm just thinking of my my hair. I'm gonna have it like super slicked back. Just very simple, like no accessories, very simple on like the hair and makeup. I'm gonna go downstairs now to breakfast. I don't know what I fancy. Um, I really don't know what I fancy, but definitely I need a coffee. So I am actually going downstairs in my slippers. These slippers from this hotel are incredible. Like one of the best hotel slippers, me and Nicole love them. And it actually says on the thing, take me home. So you don't have to tell me twice. <laughs> it's given hot mess, but like, well, don't, can I go down like this? <sighs> Whatever. So I've had some breakfast. I don't really have too much to be fair. I've got another coffee and a takeaway. I put my robe on and it's time to go and get my hair and makeup done. I'm excited. I don't know what to go for for makeup, but I'm actually excited. I feel like it's ages since I've had like a proper full glam done. So hair and makeup is done. I can officially say this room has got the worst light, like ever. <laughs> it's so bad and the window, like there's no natural light. <sighs> Okay, time to put it on. And this is the back. Oh, I've got a bra strap, but that will come off. And then let me move you down. And then it's got like a little. I think I'm gonna have to do one leg out. Okay guys, here is me all ready. What do we think? Oh, it's kind of annoying, like the material of this dress just like makes it bunch here. Like I've tried tying it tighter, but I think it's just like the sequins. So I need to go downstairs now and meet everyone in the lobby and then we'll leave. And I think we have like maybe a little drinks reception or something. I'm not 100% sure, but yes, let's go down. <laughs> Now look at me. Nice. Because you're worth it. Five little words, but I promise you it has a really big meaning. Because when you believe in yourself and your own self-worth, you can achieve anything. Now in our seventh year of partnership with the Prince's Trust, we are so proud to have empowered together thousands of young people to transform their self-doubt into self-worth. Today, we are thrilled to share the extraordinary stories of strength and confidence. Because sometimes all it takes is for someone to believe in you and help you believe in yourself. 
And who better to demonstrate this than our deserving winner? When Foamy first arrived, oh, please, please welcome Charlotte Tilbury, NBE! Um, so 